Hello? Today, I'm going to focus on DOS and DDoS attacks, critical components of the cybersecurity world. Additionally, I'll introduce you to DOS Senator, a powerful tool you can use to prevent and defend against such attacks. What are DOS and DDoS? DOS, denial of service, attacks are attempts to disrupt the availability of a service or resource by overwhelming it, consuming its resources, or exploiting vulnerabilities. Attackers aim to render the target system or service unresponsive, denying access to legitimate users. These attacks can cause considerable damage. DDoS, distributed denial of service, attacks are more extensive and complex forms of DOS attacks. Perpetrators, often from multiple sources, orchestrate a massive influx of traffic toward the target. This can be even more perilous as it amplifies the impact. DoSenator, a powerful defense tool. Effectively countering DOS attacks and evaluating these threats necessitates robust tools like DoSenator. DoSenator is a customizable DOS testing tool designed for security professionals and researchers. Here are some of its features. 1. Multiple attack modes. DoSenator supports a range of attack modes, including SWINE flood, UDP flood, ICMP flood, HTTP, DNS, OS fingerprint, slow lorries, SMIF, SCTP, and RUDY. This enables you to simulate various types of attacks. 2. Customizable parameters. Fine-tune the intensity and duration of attacks by adjusting parameters such as packet size, attack rate, and duration. 3. IP spoofing. Enhance anonymity during attacks by enabling IP spoofing to mask the source IP address. DoSenator stands out as a potent tool for simulating attacks and testing defense strategies. Conclusion. DOS and DDoS attacks pose serious threats in the realm of cybersecurity. However, tools like DoSenator can assist in strengthening security and defending against such threats. You too can leverage tools like DoSenator to bolster your security and protect your systems. If you found this information useful, please hit the like button and leave your thoughts in the comments section below. Your feedback is valuable and encourages us to create more content like this.